Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a new animation news update. I'm your host, JLB, and I have got some big news regarding my favorite show that's currently airing on Disney Channel and on Disney Junior, The PJ Masks. So this just in, over on the Disney Wiki site, which is on my computer that I'm looking at right now, they just dropped a major bombshell. There was a fourth PJ Mask. That's right. The PJ Masks were originally four. The fourth is named Armadillon. You see, like Catboy has the powers of a cat, Owlette with an owl, Gecko with a gecko. Armadillon has the powers of, you guessed it, an armadillo. He's got tough armor, and he's super strong, rivaling that of Gecko's strength. But, apparently, according to the, the site which I am looking at right now, he was formerly was formerly a student at the school the PJ Masks go to during the day, and and apparently he has a pet armadillo, just like Gecko has a pet Gecko. But regardless, he was once part of the team, but after multiple showings of recklessness, when he and the other PJ Masks were out camp trying to stop a. Uh, Romeo and his sidekick robot, the others pretty much kicked him off the team. Which, I wouldn't really blame him. I mean, Superboy could be easily kicked off of the Young, Just Young Justice team if he were reckless, but that's beside the point. The point is that this is a major, major announcement because... According to the wiki, it says that Armadillo, Armadillon's recklessness and clumsiness caused him to team up with Romeo and Robot. He's allies with them, but his enemies include the PJ Masks, Night Ninja and his Ninjalinos, and Luna Girl. Which I kinda can see why. But, but the point is, this is a major... I can't stop saying it. What else can I say? But this is a major announcement. But I still have these burning questions. How did Armadillon and the other PJ Masks get their powers? What is their origin story? What is the origin of their villains? I just... <sighs> I really do hope that Disney Junior gives us some answers to all this. Because I will not rest until I find out the origins of these superheroes and supervillains. Every superhero and supervillain story has to have an origin. Every single superhero and supervillain needs to have an origin story. We need to know the origins of the PJ Masks, their villains, and their equipment and powers. As I continue on on my eternal search for the answers, do stay tuned to Disney Channel and or Disney Junior, because the air date of the episode in which Armadillo is supposed to appear is going to be who knows when. But this... This is something. First, Disney announces three new villains for PJ Masks, the Wolfie Kids, and now Armadillo makes it four. Quite a bit of a surprise, but... But... But the night is full of surprises, isn't it? But anyway, see you all next time for another animation news update as it happens. Until next time, so long.